Greetings once again. This is Evangelist Tony Abram with Pastor Kisan, and we are going to be sharing the Word of God with you. And I love telling people about Jesus. And what Jesus can do for you. And when I'm speaking to pastors and ministers and disciples, oh, I love to challenge you a little bit. And I know I can do it because God is no respecter of persons. What he has done for others, he can do for you. Praise the Lord for his love. Now my subject tonight is called Special Miracles. Now you know the two uh, statements that I have been making all through the sessions is so important. They are important to me, but they are more important for the ministry. And, and so this is one of my last sessions, so I want to go over that one more time with you. Statement number one, the supreme task of the church is the evangelization of the world. These are some of the last words that Jesus said before he went away when he said, Go preach the gospel to every person. Then the other statement I have said that the church is the greatest source of power on earth today. The church is not some big beautiful building or some humble building. The church is the people. And you are the temple of the Holy Spirit. And now I'm going to add one more statement today. The miracle ministry of Jesus Christ is still God's indispensable method for world evangelism today. It is the most important, the miracle power of Jesus. And who does Jesus have to do this work? He has you and me. There in Mark 16, uh, many times I would say, uh, word refers to the laying of hands, that my hands are just normal hands. And I used to say that often. These are just normal, ordinary hands. But 
But then one day when I was preaching and saying that, the Holy Spirit spoke to my heart. Because I was preaching that these signs would follow them to believe, they shall lay hands on the sick, they shall recover. And I, and I had been saying, well, these are ordinary hands. And the Holy Spirit said, those are not ordinary hands. And in my heart, I said, Lord, what are you speaking to me? And the Lord said, look at your hands. And I looked at my hands. And he said, those are not ordinary hands. Those are believers' hands. Take a look at your hands right now. And if you're normal, you have you have fingers and you have a hands. But they're not ordinary hands if you know Jesus. They are believers' hands. You see, when you pray for the sick. It, these hands, in the name of Jesus, is an extension of God's hands. And the Lord said, Look you're a child of the king. Jesus Christ is Lord. And so my message today is special miracles. In the Acts, the 19th chapter, the 11th verse. And God worked special miracles by the hands of Paul. And in the next verse it says, So, so that from the body of Paul, they brought onto the sick handkerchiefs and aprons, and the disease departed from them, and evil spirits went out of the demon possessed. Now these were special miracles because they were not in the great commission from the Lord. All the other miracles were important. But here God through Paul was doing something special. And what that means is, God can do anything. You may be in an impossible situation, but God can always do a miracle and bring you out. I remember one occasion that happened when we were in the country of Honduras. And we were flying to a little island 
to hold the crusade. Hami yada saan o tapu ma hami ke yaha chahiye jahat ma yatra kare gayi rakhe kathiyo. And the plane was with one engine, one little plane. Yaha chahiye yada saan o plane ma hami gayi rakhe kathiyo. Tis ma yada ma atro engine thiyo. But they, it held five people, but they put six people in there. Yo, five jana matro jana sakle plane thiyo tarar tis ma chha jana halir lagi rakhe kothiyo thile. And I think they put some chickens and a little pig. And here we're all squeezed up in this little plane. And when he took off, he went down a grade to get speed and just barely got up in the air. Now it wasn't far, about an hour's air flight from the coast to the little island. And while we're flying, all of a sudden, the engine started to stop. It, the propeller started to slow down. And everybody got scared. And I spoke, I, I was sitting beside the pilot and I said, in the name of Jesus. And the, the propeller started to fly again and we were going, but everybody was afraid. And, and I looked out the window and the devil started to lie to me. And, and said, this plane is going to go down and you're going to drown. And I'm looking out that window, and, and then the devil says, and the sharks in the water are maybe 20 meters long. And you, you say, well, the sharks do not get that big. Well, the devil's a liar. He was lying to me. And in my heart, I said, devil, you're a liar. Get behind me. But all of a sudden, the propeller started to stop again. But again, I said, in the name of Jesus, it started to fly. And we landed on the island. And uh, on that island, they didn't have any cars or trucks. And at night, only electricity for two, three hours. So when the plane landed, uh, the people come running out to see what happened. And the pilot could not take off because the engine was broken. And they said the only reason the plane came, and they pointed at my wife and I, those are two people of God, and God brought the plane. It was a miracle. God did a special miracle. And what happened when God did a special miracle? The, that night, the whole island came almost to see the people of God. And we preached the gospel to them. Now, what do special miracles for? They are to bring people 
to Jesus. Because in the 10th verse, we find uh, of Acts 19 that it brought great revival when the God did special miracles. So you see, Paul continued after these miracles happened, special miracles, for two years, and all that lived in Asia heard the word of God. Can you imagine in that time they did not have television, no radio, no internet Zoom like we have now, no printing presses, and yet in two years. But in two years, they evangelized the whole known world. How? By special miracles. I want to say to you as a minister, or as a believer, or a disciple, do not limit God. God specializes in things we think are impossible. So special miracles happen when God wants to bring a great revival. Now, now, in this case, God used some aprons and handkerchiefs. And there was no healing in the apron or, or handkerchief. It was in the faith that Paul prayed. I, I remember we were in Paraguay, South America. And we had a national revival all over the country. People were coming to Jesus. They had one TV station, and we were on that station almost every day preaching. And God began to do miracles. Special miracles. I remember in the one place we were in this great small city having a crusade and we left. And here come a man with his horse and wagon bringing his crippled daughter. He lived way out in the country, and by the time he was able to get there, the crusade was over. Because we were going all over the country, only spending a couple of days in every city. But when the, the, they got there, we were gone, and the, and the father was very sad. 
रामी जब उ त्या पुगे हम तैं गई सकता थे बुआ तो लंगड़ो छोरी को बुआ धेरे निराश भईन् And the twelve-year-old daughter said, "Papa, put me on the ground." This was the twelfth year that the nanny said, "That the boy was laid on the ground in the jungle." He said, "Put me on the ground where God was healing the sick." That the nanny said, "Where the Lord was healing the sick, that the boy was laid on the ground in the jungle." That the nanny said, "Where the Lord was healing the sick, that the boy was laid on the ground in the jungle." She got up and she began to walk. The job of the boy is to nanny the utar and jahan to crochet by that to jamin ma rakhe pochi. For me, so ko shakti dwara to nanny ko kutta chalne bhare to hit na thalin. And 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 the revival just continued when that news got out. Job of the upura haru mani sole thaa paate is pochi thaa jaake thi ajayi bordei bordei gaye rey ko thiyo. Or like when we were in. Uh, Not far from there, in an in an amphitheater by the by the water. Ra hami tya mera dheri tada ta hoyra tar aur koi aur koi thama ek thama thiyo. They had never had a crusade in that city. Tio sahar ma kile pani istup khar ko crusade gariye kab thiye na? There was about six thousand seats, and the, all the seats were full. People could not stood on the outside. थी अंतिम दिन जब कार्यक्रम को अंतिम दिन थी हमी अब सीधा अब जाने वाला थी ते बेला नानी ने विश्वास कर निर्को पर्च म हिड़न पर्चे भादा खेल तैं उठी हिड़न थाली It was a special miracle that ignited a great revival in that city. Kina bani yo eda bishesh prakar ko aashare pura kaam thiyo. Now I remember in Pakistan. Thiyo pura sune pachi tya thulo prakar ko jagriti aayo. I remember in Pakistan something very unusual. Ra ma chai Pakistan ma euta ekdamai asadharan prakar ko ghatna ghatek kura ma samjinchu. The whole city of Lahore was uh the pastors all the churches were working with our crusade ra teti bela chai pakistan ko lahore ka sabai pastor haru sewak haru hami sanga hununthyo and they had the one of the biggest gospel tents or tents i ever seen we could put 20000 people under that tent ra teti bela चाहे and hundreds of balloons that with that were up and on there was a string ra unale chai dherai sayo unale chai tyo balloon haru testo prakar ka ke rakheka thie jo chai mathi udi raheko thiyo and on the on the on the string they had these these uh advertisements ra unyar ko thau thau ma chai esto prakar le unyar le chai thau thau ma vigyapan ko lagi chhapeka thie kar parcha haru and it had a picture of me on there ra tes ma chai vigyapan ma mero photo rakheko thiyo and then it was inviting them to come to the crusade ra tyaha lekheko thiyo ki the crusade ma aunu hos bhanera chai lekheko thiyo so after we prayed i cut the ribbon and they let hundreds of balloons go in the air ra jab hamle ra prarthna garyo prarthna garisake pachi jab maile te ribbon kaate ribbon kaatne bitikai tyaha chai sayo wata balloon har te padke thulo bhayera awaj bahir iskyo and i thought 
that is unusual. I never seen anything like that. मैले चाहिँ मलाई लाग्यो कि यो चाहिँ एकदमै असाधारण अस्वाभाविक कुरा भयो मैले कहिले पनि यस्तो देखेको थिएन बट लेट मी टेल यू वन स्पेशल मिरेकल दैट हैपन फ्रॉम दैट त्यहाँबाट एउटा विशेष प्रकारको आश्चर्यपूर्ण कुरा भयो त्यो चाहिँ म तपाईहरुलाई बताउन चाहन्छु वन बलून फ्लोटेड मेबी 250 किलोमीटर्स अवे एउटा चाहिँ त्यहाँबाट उडेर गएर झन्डै 250 किलोमिटर टाढा गएर त्यो चाहिँ पड्कियो एन्ड हियर वाज अ म्यान हु वाज प्यारलाइज्ड वन साइड बट ही वाज वॉकिंग विथ अ केन आउट इन हिज गार्डन त्यहाँ चाहिँ एउटा मान्छे थियो जसको एक साइडको भाग चल्दैन थियो उ चाहिँ आफ्नो बारीमा थियो त्यो व्हेन ऑल ऑफ अ सडन डाउन फ्रॉम द एयर केम दिस बलून and hit him on the head yo chai bakun mati gaya ra usko tauko ma aaya ra tyanira gaya par phutyo tyo and on it was one of these advertisements ra tes ma chai euta vigyapan pani thiyo jhundeko and it said you come to the crusade you must come where where healings and miracles are happening र त्यहाँ लेखिएको थियो यो क्रुसेडमा आउनु होस् किनभने यहाँ चंगाईको र प्रार्थनाको काम भइराखेको छ भनेर नाउ ही वाज अ मुस्लिम म्यान बट ही थॉट दिस वाज अ मेसेज फ्रॉम अल्लाह टू हिम उ एउटा मुस्लिम थियो र उसले चाहिँ के सोच्यो भने यो चाहिँ उनीहरुको अल्लाहबाट यो चाहिँ सन्देश आएको हो भनेर एन्ड सो ही रोड ही टुक हिज समवन फ्रॉम हिज फ्यामिली एन्ड दे केम ऑन अ ट्रेन एन्ड दे केम टू द क्रुसेड र उले त्यसपछि आफ्नो घर परिवारको कुनै सदस्यलाई लिएर त्यो कार्यक्रममा आयो He heard the gospel he received Jesus and a miracle of healing came upon him र उसले चाहिँ सुसमाचारलाई सुन्यो येशु ख्रीष्टलाई विश्वास गर्यो ग्रहण गर्यो र त्यसपछि उसको जीवनमा चंगाई आयो This was a special miracle यो चाहिँ एउटा विशेष प्रकारको आश्चर्यपूर्ण काम थियो And he could go back to his village and tell what jesus did for him rahu tes pachi tya bada farker aphno gaun gayo ra yesu le sujena ke garnu bhayo tyu kura ule tya gara batayo god has always done special miracles parmeshwar le jaile pani vishesh prakar ka aashirpana kaam haru garnu huncha wahan le in acts the 5th chapter the 12th verse listen to this prerit 5 ko 12 ma hernu hos by the hands of the apostles were many signs and wonders done among the people ya lekheko cha aba prerit haru ka hat bata dherai chinha haru ra aacharya karma haru janta ka bich ma huna lage ra tini haru sabai solomon ko darbar ma ek sath jama bhayeka thie and down in the 15th verse it says in so much they brought forth the sick in the streets and laid them on beds and couches that at least the shadow of peter passing by might overshadow some of them 15 pad ma yahan esari dikho cha yahan samma ki maatrale sadak sadak ma birami halai lyae ra patrus aunda tinko chhaya matra bhaye pani tini haru madhe koi koi mati parosh bhani ochyaun ra khat haru ma tini halai sutai rakdathe and in the next verse it says and there came a multitude of people out of the cities round about Jerusalem bringing sick folks and them that were vexed with unclean spirits and they were healed every one ra ya sora pada baneko cha jerusalem ka wari pari ka shahar har bata pani dherai manis har le birami haru ra ashuddha atma le satai ka har lai liyera aunte ra ti sabai niko hunthe now God did special did special miracles and people came to Jesus. र यहाँ परमेश्वरले विशेष प्रकारको आश्चर्यपूर्ण कामहरु गर्नु भयो र मानिसहरु चाहिँ क्रिसमा आउन थाले. Now did God does God or did God love Peter and Paul more than he loves us? No. He loves us all the same. के परमेश्वरले पत्रुस र पावललाई हामी भन्दा बढ्ता प्रेम गर्नुहुन्छ यस्तो होइन उहाँले उहाँ तिनीहरुलाई र हामीलाई एउटै प्रकारले प्रेम गर्नुहुन्छ लिसन टु सम अफ द साइन्स एन्ड वन्डर्स दैट टुक प्लेस इन द बुक अफ एक्ट्स 
तपाईले यहाँ प्रेरितको पुस्तकमा भएका आश्चर्यपूर्ण चिन्हहरू र आश्चर्य कामहरूको बारेमा तपाई हेर्नुहोस् हबर एननायस एन्ड सेफेरा व्हेन दे लाइड टु द होली स्पिरिट एन्ड दे वर स्ट्रक डाउन डेड र हामीलाई थाहा छ हननिया र सफिराले जब तिनीहरूले ढाट्ने प्रयास गरे तिनीहरू दुईटै मरेर गए दैट वाज अ स्केरी अ साइन एन्ड वन्डर यो चाहिँ एकदमै डरलाग्दो प्रकारको चिन्ह हो जो चाहिँ प्रेतको पुस्तकमा भयो बट व्हाट अबाउट पीटर बीइंग इन जेल पत्रु जब जेलमा थिए त्यतिबेला के भयो हियर ही वाज लॉक्ड अप बोथ हैंड्स बिटवीन टू सोल्जर्स अब यहाँ चाहिँ पत्रुसको दुईटै हातहरू साङ्गलाले बाँधिएको थियो र दुईटा सिपाहीहरु त्यसको वरिपरि थिए दे वर गोइंग टु किल द नेक्स्ट डे भोलिपल्ट मात्र पत्रुसलाई मार्न गइराखेका थिए तिनीहरुले But here the Bible says that he was sleeping between the two soldiers. Bible le ban sakti ni chay duita sipayer ko bich ma suti rahe ka thiye. Boy, I don't know if I knew next day they were going to cut my head off, I would have hard time sleeping, but Peter could sleep. Mala lag sa yadi bolim mala maane ho bhare mala thaat sa bane mota sutna sakdai na hola thora patrus chay yaha suti rahe ka chon. because he was believing god for a miracle kira bhane usle chahe parmeshwar le aachare kaam garnu huncha bhanne kura ma vishwas garireko thiyo he knew the church was praying in the upper room kira bhane usko lagi mandali harle prarthna garirachha chan bhanne kura ulai thaha thiyo and then at the midnight hour an angel came ra ra aadha raat tir ta yaha swarga dud aunu bhayo and kind of smoked and said peter wake up put your shoes on get ready <laughs> र त्यसपछि त्यहाँ स्वर्गदूत आएर भन्नुहुन्छ पत्रुस पत्रुस उठ र मसँग हिड भने जाग भनेर एन्ड द थिंग्स फेल अफ ऑफ हिज ह्यान्ड्स एन्ड ही स्टुड अप उसका हातका साङ्गलाहरु चाहिँ फुत्के आफै र त्यसपछि उ खडा भयो बट द सोल्जर्स केप्ट ऑन स्लीपिंग तर दुईटै तल सिपाहीहरु त सुतिरहेकै थिए दे केम टु द गेट एन्ड ऑल ऑफ अ सडन बाय इटसेल्फ द गेट ओपेन्ड जब तिनीहरु चाहिँ बाहिर गेट परमेश्वर द्वारा Peter thought it was a dream, a nice dream from the Lord. Kino ne yo banda agari patrus ne sochhe ki mata yada ramro mitto sapna dekhi rakhe kuchh banana sochhi rahega thi. But no, it was a miracle. Praise the Lord. Tar teso hoy na yo ta yada ashri puna kam thi ho aur mister ko stuti ho. And then what about Paul and Silas in jail? Paul ra Silas jab jail ma thi 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 bilakhi hoy ho. They had been beaten, and then they had their hands, and they were locked, and their feet were locked. Unni har lai korra haru lagaiyo Peter ra unni har lai chaaye thingur hole baad ra hath kuta baad ra jail jail khan ma rakhe kothiyo. But at midnight they were singing praise to the Lord. Tarra unni har aada raat tera permission lai aradna kar rahe kathiye. And what happened? The the prison was shaken, and the doors all opened. त्यसपछि के भयो आधा रातितिर त्यहाँ भुइचालो गयो र त्यहाँ जेलहरु झल्लियो र उसको उनीहरुको हातका साङ्गलाहरु सबै फुत्किए एन्ड द जेलर वाज गोइंग टु किल हिमसेल्फ र त्यहाँको झालकानको हाकिमले आफैले आफैले अपहत्या गर्ने प्रयास गरे एन्ड यु रिमेम्बर व्हाट पीटर अ पॉल सेड वी आर ऑल हियर डोंट हर्ट यू सेल्फ र त्यसपछि पावलले भन्छ आफैले अपहत्या नगर नगर किनभने हामी सबै जना यही छ भनेर भने Now why didn't the prisoners run away? The, the doors were all open. None of the prisoners ran away. Kina the ha jail khan ko jail dhokar khule pani kune pani koi di haru the amara bhage na kina esu gaya hagan. I believe those prisoners were converted because of the miracle God did for Paul and Silas. मलाई लाग्छ पावल र सिलासको कारणले जो परमेश्वरले त्यहाँ आश्चर्य काम गर्नुभयो त्यो कुरालाई देखेर त सबै कैदीहरू सन्तोना पाएका थिए हाउ अबाउट पाउल अन द आइल्यान्ड व्हेन ही शुक दैट स्नेक अफ एन्ड अ रिवाइवल ब्रोक अफ अन द होल आइल्यान्ड 
रावल जब एट टापू में थे रौरा लिया सर्प को हाथ में थे उनके झटकारे आगो में गए पे भो पूरे टापू में जागृति आयो देख uh joseph joseph into the lions den ra tya chai yosef lai jaba jaba lagi cha sorry daniel into the into the lions den daniel lai ho maaf garna daniel lai ho the lions didn't bother him ra tara tyo sih ko khor na halda pani daniel lai sih le kehi pani garna sakenan and the king saw it was a special miracle from the living god नीड इज देर परमेश्वरले तपाईको लागि गर्नुहुने छ यदि त्यहाँ आवश्यकता र खाँचो छ भने There is no situation or problem that is too big for God परमेश्वरको लागि कुनै पनि समस्या र कुनै पनि परिस्थिति ठूलो छैन If you ever get discouraged read the 11th chapter of Hebrews यदि तपाई कहिले पनि विश्वासमा निराश हुनुहुन्छ भने हिब्रुको 11 अध्यायलाई पढ्नुहोस् and you'll see victory after victory tapaile tya vijay mathi vijay dekhdai janu hune cha god can perform the impossible parmeshwar le asambhav lai sambhav banaunu huncha mark 923 says jesus said if you can believe all things are possible to him that believes मार्कस 9 को 15 मा येशू प्रभुले के भन्नु भएको छ यदि तिमीले विश्वास गरे भने तिम्रो लागि सबै कुराहरू सम्भव हुने छन् एन एक्स 10:34 गॉड इज नो रिस्पेक्टर अफ पर्सन्स र उहाँले प्रेरित 10 को 14 मा उहाँले भन्नुहुन्छ परमेश्वरले तिमीहरूलाई जहिले पनि सहायता गर्नुहुन्छ एन्ड रिमेम्बर व्हाट ही हैज डन फर अदर्स ही कैन डू फर यू यदि वहाँ ने अरु को लाइक ये गौर सकने उनसे मन तपाई को लागी पनी वहाँ ले गौर सकने उनसा। Now, I believe that all these like Peter, Paul, Silas, I believe all of them were men of prayer. मगर विश्व के विश्वास कर सब वाले यहाँ पत्रों, पावल, सिलास, जोशन इन्हें सब ये जाना प्रार्थना का योद्ध बाहर हुई है। Is if God is going to do something special in your life. You have to be a person of prayer. यदि परमेश्वर ने तपाईको जीवनमा विशेष काम गर्न गइराख्नु भएको छ भने तपाई प्रार्थनाको योद्धा हुन आवश्यक छ. My wife is a woman of prayer. मेरो श्रीमती चाहिँ प्रार्थनाको स्त्री हुनुहुन्छ. She starts the day with between 2 and 3 hours of prayer. उनले हरेक दिनलाई 2 देखि 3 घण्टा सम्म प्रार्थना गरेर सुरुवात गर्छिन्। Now it isn't how long but it's how you pray that's so important. तपाईले कति लामो प्रार्थना गर्नुहुन्छ त्यो भन्दा पनि तपाईले कसरी प्रार्थना गर्नुहुन्छ त्यो ठुलो कुरा हो. We need to be able to pray the prayer of faith. तपाई र मैले प्रार्थना गर्ने कुरा यसरी गर्नु पर्छ त्यो चाहिँ विश्वास साथ प्रार्थना गर्नु पर्छ. Because faith moves the hand of God. किनभने विश्वासले परमेश्वरको हातहरूलाई तपाईतिर बढाइदिन्छ फेथ इन व्हाट फेथ इन गॉड एन्ड फेथ इन हिज प्रोमिसेस 
विश्वास के कुरा में विश्वास परमेश्वर में रहा विश्वास वहां का प्रतिज्ञा जब यीशु का चेला यीशु कहाँ प्रार्थना को लागी आऊँ सन। In the eleventh chapter, the first verse of Luke, and it came to pass as he was praying a certain place. When he finished, one of the disciples said to him, "Lord, teach us to pray." जब तहाँ प्रार्थना भाई सके जी लुगाय को पहलू आ दिया है मैं तो तीस पच्चीस तहाँ चेला हरे यीशु लाई बंसन की प्रभु हमले प्रार्थना कौशल ही गाने बने रा हमले शिकायत दिनों बने रा बनना उनसन। Now if you were Jewish, you would find this very surprising. यदि तपाईं यहूदी हो बने यो तपाईं को लागे एकदम ये आश्चर्यजनक कुरा उनसा। Because from a child, a Jew is taught. How to pray? You know, Yehudi are like sane. They can they consider prata ganu parsa bani ra unyalai sika insa. But you see, the disciples did not just want prayers that they memorized, but they wanted to pray like Jesus prayed. Kina bani unyalai jo sane they ki kantha gari ko prata gar jasari garte tesari hoy na tar Yeshu le jasta prata garat chante tei praya sika imagi unyalai. And so they said, Lord. Teach us to pray the way you pray. तेरे लिए घर आता हूँ उन्हें ले आया रहा बंसार पर वो जब से तपाईले प्रार्थना करने से तेरे लिए हमला इतनी प्रार्थना करने सिखाए दिनों हैं. Because when the Lord prayed, things happened. कि न वाले यीशु ले प्रार्थना कर दाखिल थे हाँ आज से ले पूरा काम और उन्हें. You see, if Jesus took time to pray, how much more time you and I need to pray? यदि यीशु प्रभु स्वयं ले पाने प्रार्थना को लागी समय छुट्टियाँ उन्हें उन्हें बने तपाईर मलाई जान प्रार्थना को लागी कती धरे समय छुट्टियाँ उन्हें पड़ला। He did not say to them that they could not pray the way he prayed, but he told them how to pray. वहाँ ले आपुले गरे जस्ते ही प्रार्थना गरे को लागी तीनों लाई बन्नु भाई ना तर कसरी प्रार्थना गरे उपर्चतियों लाखों मानी सोले प्रार्थना करें कासवान तरह कौसली प्रार्थना करने होती हूँ धेरे इले घरे का सही नन। They even pray in hell because you remember Abraham could see the beggar could see and Abraham could see them praying on the side where they were suffering. किन्ह वाले नरक में पड़े मानी सोले प्रार्थना करी रहे कासन हमें लाये था जो तो लाजरस को मालिक ले जाते हैं प्रार्थना करी रहे कुकरा हमें जो घर ना लाये था पाऊं सम। In the 16th chapter of Luke it says that the rich man was praying in hell। किन्ह वाले लुक का सोरा अध्याय में त्याह धनी मानी सोले प्रार्थना करी कुकरा त्याह सा। So just saying words isn't enough. यो खाली बनाइले मात्रा बोलेरे मात्रा हुनाई नहीं उकरा। The pattern that Jesus gave for us in our prayer life is that we need to approach our heavenly Father and realize we are a child of God. किन्ह बने यीशु प्रभुले जब हमले प्रार्थना करना सिखाऊं न बोले तेरी वेला वहाँ ले बने बो हे हमरा पिता जो स्वर्ग मा बुनुंसा बने रा हमी वहाँ का संतान हो बने कुरा घोषणा कर दे वहाँ ले सिखाऊं न बायो। But let but let me say this: the first prayer God will ever hear is the prayer of a sinner. वह परमेश्वर ले हमी अरु को प्रार्थना तथा पापी को प्रार्थना सुनने उनसे त्यों कराया मत पहले बताऊं चांसों। When a sinner comes to Jesus and says, "I am a sinner. I ask for your forgiveness." God hears that prayer. जब ये वाला पापी ले बच्चा कि हे पिता माँ ये वाला पापी हूँ मत आए कुछ चरण माँ उच्च बने रहो माफ़ी लाप स्वीकार रहा हूँ सा त्यों प्रार्थना परमिशन ले सुनने उनसा And so Jesus taught our Father which is in heaven. यीशु ले प्रार्थना शुरू करता कौशल बनो हे हमरा पिता जो स्वर्ग माँ उन्होंने उनसा And to be able to say our Father, you have to be a child of God. And if you want special miracles to ever happen in your life and in your ministry, you have to know God, the Father, and you that you are His child. 
यदि तपाई को व्यक्तिगत जीवन में तपाई को शोभा काय में आश्चर्य पूर्ण काम हो रहा है को देखना चाहें उनसे बने वन उस परमेश्वर मेरे पिता हूँ उनसे मैं वह को संतान हूँ भन्ने कुरान में विश्वास करनुँस एंड कैन यू डू दैट यस यू कैन तपाई लियो काम गाना सकनुँस कि गाना सकनुँस हो पक्का गाना सकनुँस आफ्टर यू प्रे द प्रे जब तश्चाताप को प्रार्थना कर परमेश्वर ने तीवन काम कर दोसों तम पवित्र सो दिसमेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंटेंट